Hong Kong's chief executive Leong Chuan Ying has faced mounting calls to step down. The latest happened on New Year's Day. Of course, many in Hong Kong still support him, but local media are highlighting the connection of some of those backing Leong and authorities in mainland China. Tens of thousands of demonstrators took to the streets on Tuesday against Hong Kong's chief executive Leong Chun Ying. Also rallying on Tuesday was a smaller group supporting Hong Kong's leader, but they may have been there because of influences from mainland China. As the protest took place, footage surfaced online showing some of those supporters were paid to be there. On Wednesday, Hong Kong media reported the payment likely came from this man. Choi Chi Fung is the associate director of publicity for the New Territories General Chamber of Commerce. Hong Kong-based Ming Pao newspaper says the business group has ties to the mainland. Several of its former and existing members were part of different political advisory bodies in China. We're worried that the central authorities in Beijing are infiltrating Hong Kong groups. If they are, the so-called one country, two system promise or the autonomous rule of Hong Kong basically exists only in name now. The New Year's Day protests against Leung Chun Ying largely called for him to step down. A scandal over illegal structures in his home has put his integrity into question. Leung has also not been able to shake accusations he has close ties with communist authorities in Beijing. The New Territories General Chamber of Commerce has not responded to accusations it paid the protesters. NTD visited the headquarters on Thursday but found no one inside the office. NTD News, Hong Kong.